What's going on with y'all? It's Jeff Lightsey Jr. here with the Ball Sports Network. And I watched this interview by Kevin Durant on Showtime. He did it with uh, All the Smoke podcast with Matt Barnes and Steven Jackson. And Kevin Durant, one thing about Kevin Durant, we could say, you know, you can call him sensitive and call him what. He is very, very open and honest. He's one of those guys, he doesn't care who he's talking to. He's going to say what's on his mind. And he's always going to let it be known how he's feeling. And a lot of what he said on that podcast is being discussed from him. He still uses burner accounts. So for those who don't know, Kevin Durant, back in the day, was he was caught slipping is what he said on the podcast. He tweeted as if he was in third person talking about himself defending himself but it was supposed to be on a fake Twitter account, and but he accidentally did it on his own. And so that's when people found out that he actually has several burner accounts that he tweets at people that talk bad about him on Twitter, and he defends himself through that. So he still does that, <laughs> even after being exposed. But one thing that he said, he talked about why he left OKC. And a lot of people are giving him flack for this, and I don't see why. He said that in on that team, especially that last team, OKC, he didn't play with a lot of skilled ball players. He played with a lot of athletic guys, like guys that were really good at jumping and dunking and maybe even defense, but couldn't really ball handle and shoot threes. And when he went to Golden State, they were a team full of three-point shooters and guys that could handle the ball, Draymond, Steph, Clay, obviously, and then they would be adding him. And I don't find anything wrong with that. People are saying, oh, he's taking a dig at his team and, you know, he shouldn't have been doing that. Why not? We always ask our athletes to be more open and honest with us and not give us the scripted answer. But when they do, we criticize them. That's stupid. And Kevin Durant wasn't wrong. I'm looking at this OKC. So this is the OKC roster, the 2015-2016 roster, the last team, OKC team that Kevin Durant played for. Um and this is the list of guys on here. Steven Adams, a center, no ball handling, no skill. Nick Collison, he was old, no skill. It's Durant, Randy Foy, oh, journeyman, no real skill. John Hurtis, I don't even know who that is. Serge Ibaka, no real skill. He was still developing himself. Uh, Mitch McGarry, a forward center from out of Michigan, no skill. Anthony Morrow was a three-point shooter, but that's about it. And he was a journeyman at 29 years old. No, no. Uh, Cameron Payne, a guy who could never find the court. He was a lottery pick for them out of uh, Murray State, but he he was never able to develop in anything. He's been a journeyman ever since. Andre Roberson, a defensive specialist, no shooting, no skill. Dion Waiters, who was a guy who has some skill and ability, but was hard to deal with, is a bad teammate. Uh, that's being proven. That's why Deion Waiters isn't playing right now. Uh, several years later, as talented as he is, he's not a really good teammate. And then Russell Westbrook. So Kevin wasn't lying. Like, there was nothing that Kevin Durant said in that All the Smoke podcast that wasn't the truth. None of these guys, a lot of these guys aren't even in the league anymore. Let's let that be known. So that, that makes a difference. And none of these guys had the three-point shooting ability or playmaking ability that was gonna lead them to a championship. Kevin Durant wasn't wrong. So I've never faulted, here's the thing, I, as I've gotten, as the years went by, I started to realize more and more why Kevin Durant left OKC for the for the Warriors. I mean, guaranteeing them some championships, and, and even in what he said in that podcast, he played with more talented, more skilled players, and it helped him develop his game, become a better player than he was back in OKC. Yeah, you can say he should have been the best player and lead the team that drafted him to a championship. Man, forget all of that. Like Kevin Durant, you want to make your money and to go down as one of the best players ever to play this game. And the only way to do that is by winning championships. And that's what exactly he did. And this roster would not have won him a championship. It's obvious that's why they didn't win when they were down when they were up 3-1 over the Warriors. And that's why he said everything he said in that all the smoke podcast. You let me know. Was Kevin Durant wrong for calling out this list of guys who I just listed off to you and saying they had no skill? Which they didn't. You let me know. Was he wrong for saying that in the media? Once again, my name is Jeff Lightsey Jr., the Ball Sports Network. Thank you for watching. Continue to like and subscribe. Hit the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.